James Kaufman will news report today, December 22nd, 2024. God bless you and yours, no matter where you are in the world. Please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, ring that bell for critical future updates. NASA's Parker Solar Probe to make closest approach to Sun. A NASA spacecraft aims to fly closer to the Sun than any object ever sent by humans. The Parker Solar Probe was launched in 2018 to get a close-up look at the Sun. Since then, it has flown straight through the Sun's corona, the outer atmosphere visible during a total solar eclipse. The next milestone, the close approach to the Sun. Plans call for the Parker Solar Probe on Tuesday, Christmas Eve, to hurtle through the sizzling solar atmosphere and pass within a record-breaking 3.8 million miles of the Sun's surface. Remember, the Sun is 93.3 million miles away from Earth. So this is very, very close to the Sun. Earth is very close to the Sun. For some perspective, at that moment, if the Sun and the Earth were at opposite ends of a football field, Parker Solar Probe would be on the four-yard line, said NASA's Joe Westlake. Mission managers won't know how Parker fared until days after the flyby, since the spacecraft will be out of communication range during that time. The Parker Solar Probe has planned to get more than seven times closer to the Sun than any previous spacecraft, hitting 430,000 miles per hour at its close approach. It's the fastest spacecraft ever built and is outfitted with a heat shield that can withstand scorching temperatures up to 2,500 degrees Fahrenheit? Well, how did they get through the Van Allen belts then? The Parker Solar Probe will continue circling the sun at this distance until at least September of next year. Scientists hope to better understand why the corona is hundreds of times hotter than the sun's surface and what drives the solar wind, the supersonic stream of charged particles constantly blasting away from our sun. The sun's warming rays make life possible here on Earth, but severe solar storms can temporarily scramble radio communications, disrupt power, and more. The sun is currently at the maximum phase of its 11-year solar cycle, triggering an uptick in solar activity and colorful auroras in unexpected places back here on Earth. It's both our closest and friendliest neighbor, Westlake said, but at times it gets a little angry. God bless you and yours, folks. Please share, subscribe, and always remember, anything's possible. Bizarro world.